take a swing. Get the fuck take out of here. Swing, you get a yeah. shit. Online, take swing. online tough guy. Swing. Online tough guy. How's he online? Quad, you hit him first, bro. Like, are you some accountability? Get away, get away with that bat. Get away with that bat, bro. Get away with that bat. What are you doing? What are you doing, sort of? Okay, get the fuck out of here with that bat. Fuad Abiyaz was involved in a serious assault because of someone harassing his wife. But what's the real truth behind this story? I'm going to tell you everything, so stay tuned. First of all, let me tell you this came to light because of Greg Doucette's video, but he deleted it later. This shows Greg messed up, but after that, Fuad explained everything on Instagram. So let's try to understand the full story. So this is the video. Actually, these are two videos totaling four minutes that Fuad uploaded on Instagram. In the video, you can see two guys sitting in a car outside Fuad's house honking their horn. Fuad comes out with a baseball bat. Fuad's house. And she goes right to Fuad's house. And there he is. He comes out with a bat. You record that. You're like, yeah, come on. You, you want to put down the bat? No, no, no bat. Put no bat. bat put the bat down. Bitch. Put the bat down. Fuad, put the bat down. What are you doing? Fuad, put the bat down. Fuad, put the bat down. He's just here to talk. Don't worry about it. Put the bat down. Okay, just put the bat down. He doesn't have a weapon. He doesn't have a weapon. What are you doing? Coming out with your bat. You told me to come over. What are you going to do now? Fuck something. Take a swing there. Take a swing. But why do you have a bat? Why do you have a bat? Why do you think I have a bat? You guys are the same fucking size, you idiot. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Go call the police. Call the police. Yeah. Go ahead. Okay. For you. Okay. Yeah. Real tough. Okay. Fuck you, bitch. Take a swing. Take a swing. Take a swing. Get the fuck out of here. You get a shit. Online tough guy. Online tough guy. Online tough guy. How's he online? Fred, you hit him first, bro. Like, are you kidding me? Oh, yeah, don't roll up on me, bro. I'm not here to fight. I'm not here to fight. Get back in the fucking. Yeah, I'm getting back in the car, but don't worry about who we are. What do you mean online tough guys? After Fuad hits him, they back off. Fuad called him online tough guy and he is because after getting hit, he's saying Fuad hit me so hard I can't even drive. You fucking pussy. Josh, you gotta drive bro. This guy hit me in the head so hard I can't drive. Then this guy comes back outside and we see this happening. Do you wanna leave or do you, like he dropped the bat? Like... Get it Josh, Josh, get it. Yeah, I am. I am a hockey coach. Yeah, that's why. No, no, no. That's why I was telling like, that Mike Van Wick should be a little accountable. But you have this guy's back for no reason, bro. Yeah, I coach little kids and teach them accountability. I, I teach them accountability. Get away. Get away with that bat. Get away with that bat, bro. Get away with that bat. What are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, get the fuck out of here with that bat. Get out of here with that bat. Let me stop them. I can't. I can't do anything. Then, you better stop them. then let me stop you them. This guy's trying to hit me with the bat. I'm trying to. I, I don't want to hit you. I'm not trying to hit you. I'm not even trying to hit her. I'm not even trying to hit her. Get the fuck out of here. I'm trying to stop them. I'm trying to take the bat away, you hit me! Can you Let's stop them. stop them! In the caption, Fuad wrote, This happened yesterday. Unfortunately, when someone harasses your wife for years on end, eventually it has to be dealt with. Fuad gave the full context of the situation on Instagram stories. He said, This guy is Misha Ristik, who used to be his friend 10 years ago, but was a drug addict, so Fuad cut ties with him. For the last few years, this guy has been harassing and threatening Fuad's wife through emails, which you can read, showing how much of a psychopath this guy is. Fuad said he hadn't spoken to Misha in years, but yesterday, Yesterday he called him and they exchanged a lot of nasty shit. Fuad told him if he want come and deal with it. So he came, they fought and the police got involved. Fuad said in my mind this is over now. Right after this drama Greg Doucette made a video saying Fuad was wrong without understanding the full story. Fuad said Greg did this because he hates him and wanted to make him look bad. Now it's look like Greg made a huge mistake which is why he deleted the video. I didn't get to watch it but if you did let me know what he actually said. I think Greg will make another video to apologize for this. Let's see. In my opinion, Fuad did nothing wrong. He just protected his family. Let me know your thoughts on this whole situation in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe for more updates. I am Hoos. Catch you soon.
bite. You have a baseball bat in your hand, bro. You have a fucking baseball bat in your hand, man.